Hello everyone, Captain Laserguns here for another episode of Lasercraft. And today we're here in our sheep cow farm thingy. And you're probably wondering, Captain Lays Guns, what is this maniacal device? Maniacal? Why are you guys using words like this? I don't even know what that means. And you're probably wondering what this thing is. Now, the other day I was thinking, man, I need to short those sort, those sheep and cows. And look at them. Look at his face. He's like, man, man, I don't like it with all these cows. They're giving me funny looks. Look at that. Those cows. This cow, this cow's giving me funny looks. And basically, this is a sorting device, which I've spent a lot of time and effort on. As you can see, look, it's just the design. It's amazing. So, I'm going to run a minecart down here, and I'll show you guys how it works. Basically, what we do is, uh, well, well we don't do that. But we, we, we need to get... Okay, that, that doesn't work. It, see, it's, it's fail. I haven't even tested it out yet. It's, it's just, it's all over the place. Alright, so if... if, if let, let, yeah, uh, up here. Alright. Okay, so now I just need to place that. And if I put the minecart here, and then jump on it. Look, it, oh, it picks up the cow. And then the cow goes through. And we sort of decide, oh man, is, is that a cow or a sheep? And then we send it through. And there's, there's a... C what? What? Oh yeah, that's right. Awesome! So now we have a cow in a minecart. Then we just get rid of the minecart, leave the cow, and that's a cow sorted. And basically, to get their attention, I have this wheat. And this is really the simplest way I could find to sort cows and sheep because they're not really that easy to sort but if I can get one of them in there come on get get in it okay this is why it needs a bit of a push because sometimes they're a little bit persistent not to get in and oh and that's most likely gonna kill the cow now I'm gonna feel bad yeah that killed the cow <sighs> all right let's let's run it through again let's just try this one last time Alright, and we didn't pick up anything that time, yay! Alright, let's, let's try it again. Look, there's a cow. Uh, he's in. And then we send him through to the other cow. And if the cow gets out of the way, as you can tell, this, this is a perfect system. This system is just, it works so well in all different kinds of ways. Hey, let's let's run through again. Oh, we've got a sheep. So what do we do? Oh, yeah, awesome! It works. I feel like Anakin Skywalker from Star Wars when he sings. Where he's like, "It's working! It's working!" If you haven't watched Star Wars, you're probably going to think I'm weird. I get most people do. It's normal. It's a cool thing to do. All right. It's, it's, yeah. All right. We run it through again. Well, we didn't get anything that time. I am appalled and shocked. No! For some reason, they really, really want to get in here. But if I do this, then they come straight out. But then they surround me with their demon eyes. Alright, let, let me, let, let me... No! Why are you so keen on getting in there? That's... <laughs> Alright. Alright, come on, come on, come on. Let me out. Let... Good. Now I just call them all over, grab their attention, and then run the minecart down. Oh, no! Get through! And I switch it over, I send the cow, cow, on through. And I know that at one point these cows are actually going to escape, but oh well, they're, they're cool. I think we maybe need to give them more room. Just maybe, but at the moment they should be fine. Now, oh, I was going to say something, but I can't remember. That's, that's the most annoying thing. What was I going to say? Think. Think, Captain Lays Guns. Think. Um. Um. Why? Why don't you want the wheat? Come on. Come grab the wheat. All right. Sweet. Get, get out of my way. 
This system is not at all perfect. I recommend not using it. I'm only using it because, well, it worked for me. Like, see, now the sheep's stuck. And so I need to push him manually. Oh, well, I like being a sheep pusher. Alright. Now, the main reason why I'm actually doing this is because I want to sort the sheep from the cows so that I can color the sheep and have sort of like a whole system for it so that I can make some nice structures using, say, blue wool and that because I have lots and lots of lapis lazuli. Now, if I can grab the, uh, the other mob's attention and then jump up. So, as you can see, it it's simple, but it works. It's effective... And, uh, I actually wouldn't say it's effective, but but it's simple, and that's what matters. Anyway, I'll probably leave this and do the rest of it off camera because this is probably about as exhilarating as watching armpit hair grow. All right, so let's look at some of the other additions I've made to the base. I've oh, what are these? Well, I'll tell you what they are. They're cats. That's what they are. Well, no. Basically, what happened is for the last. A lot of episodes, I've been exploring the jungle in Peaceful. And the problem with that is that, well, in Peaceful, the ocelots don't spawn. And when they don't spawn, it means they can't turn into cats. So I was like, oh, well, I didn't know this. So I went into Easy, and literally within the first second of going into that, into that jungle, found a cat. I found two cats. There was actually a baby one in there. I was a bit confused by that. But anyway, these are our two new very cute guys. I'm thinking that we should hold a competition to name them like how Wild Out here are one McSexingtons. I think I spelled that wrong. McSexingtons? I think it's Ingtons. No, I don't quite know. I don't quite remember. I'll go back and look at the comment later. But I think we should name the cats and I'll let you guys name them. Basically, if you want to name them, leave a comment in the comment section below and write, hmm, I want to name the ginger cat. So you say ginger cat, bum. And then if you want to name the black cat, you can call him the potion master. And so you can only name one. Well, you can name two in one comment, but you can only win for one. So that's sort of how it's going to roll. And anyone can win, because I sort of choose it at random. And also a little bit off personal preference, as in not as in personal preference of the person, more as in personal preference of just just like like the name and stuff. Cause sexism, come on, what is not sexy about that? And also spam in the comments will not give you a better chance at winning. It will make it look silly though. And I wanna show you guys this. It's something sort of inspired by Ethos Lab, if any of you watch it. I am. I am. I love Ethos Lab. He's awesome. And basically what you do, put in a speed potion, and you run up to it, and you're like, oh, Wow, I'm so fast. What's going on? I don't know, because I'm so fast. And then you run out here, and you're like, Oh, man, what's going on, Mr. Sun? I am so fast. And then the sun's like, Kill the pig, and I must obey. <laughs> oh, I don't know what just happened. Uh, this commentary today, I am I'm so tired. I've been so busy this week. I just felt like making a video today, so I'm just having a really good time making this. And really, this video has has no objective. Um, oh, this is something I can show you. If I go down here... I'll show you something pretty neat. I've been finding lots of mob spawners everywhere. I found a completely new cave system. Uh, I don't think it's connected to uh, our old one at all. And I'm pretty excited by this. Look, if, if we go down here, you're going to be like, Oh man, Captain Lazy Guns, what's this? And I'm going to be like, well, well, look. Look at this. It's another mob spawner. Which means we can have a zombie mob spawner, which means we can have all the zombie loot and stuff like that. But I didn't collect any of the loot because I wanted to show you guys first. That's 
That's just how much I care for you all. And this is our new cave system. It's huge, and it goes on forever. And sort of, sort of already pillaged most of it. Uh, I don't think there's any diamond anywhere. I think, yeah, I sort of got all of the diamond. Uh, there's lots of redstone. Definitely lots of redstone and gold. There happens to be a lot of gold. And I'm sort of waiting for the new snapshot to come out because I'm really excited for that. Considering that now, when you smelt iron or you smelt, uh, I think, gold, you actually get experience from it. And also, if you mine diamond or if you mine redstone or anything like that, you get experience from that as well. So that's pretty awesome. Plus, also some of the additions. I have been contemplating actually starting a new world when this new snapshot comes out. Whether it would be separate from this LP or not, like I was thinking maybe have a completely separate hardcore series, which would probably come out a little less than Lasercraft because, oh no, oh no, <laughs> because I love doing the Lasercraft series and I would never stop doing this and I would never stop uploading for you guys. But yeah, I reckon it would be awesome to have Maybe a few different series going, uh, which were all my own Minecraft things. Like, I do have a lot of other series, but they're sort of based off custom apps and based off compilations, stuff like that. And also, that reminds me, I need to get the next Hunger Games out. And also the next Shrinkcraft. Yes, they are all recorded. They're all there. Just need to get them out. I got some shiny iron armor, and I don't know how long I've been recording for. I... I... I don't know. But, ooh, what's this? Did I place this? Is this? Is this the same one? I think it is. It is the same one. I know there's a spider one around here, but I should have marked it because I've lost it. And I would like having a spider spawner. It would be good. But no, I can't find it. Ah, uh, well, it's definitely not up there. Hmm. Well, I think we should head back up to the top. Step up. I, I really want to get more into building and stuff like that. I sort of, I've been getting, I don't know, I really want to get into the redstone and all that. But I don't really have any slime balls or anything to make anything interesting with, like, pistons. Though I reckon it would really add to the LP if we had sort of, like, uh, sort of redstone and all that. People seem to enjoy that, like... If you would like that, just leave a thumbs up. And if you like thumbs up, leave a thumbs up. And if you like this little bush, leave a thumbs up. And if you like that tree, well, go ahead and just leave a like. And if, if you don't like the tree, tell me why in the comment section below. Alright, so, I don't know what else we have to do. I have glass? Well, I didn't even know I had glass. I don't think there's anything in here. We could do an enchantment. Mm, can't enchant a hoe. Hmm. I don't think there's anything else. Oh, I didn't show you guys this thing. And I'll eat my watermelon. It's the first time I've ever eaten watermelon on a series. Look at that, I'm eating that watermelon. Do you want some watermelon? That's all you're getting. Yeah. This is sort of a, a new room kind of thing it's well it's sort of like an addition of an old room and I, I've lit it up make it all awesome I don't know what I'm gonna put in here I'm thinking maybe just put in put in something awesome something nice maybe if we put well well that's not a very good place for a door now is it I need this I also need this Awesome. So I think that that might be all for the episode. Uh, oh, actually, no, I do know something that I haven't shown you guys, which I might go over and show you guys just before the end of the episode, because you're going to be like, oh my gosh, that is so amazing. All right, so let me just eat this before we go on an epic quest. And we should take one of our splash potions. I need to make a lot more of those. I do have the nether one, although well, I'm just, I'm just lazy. Alright. That's, uh... What do I do? Let's get rid of that iron. Should I get rid of the cactus? 
Yeah, get rid of the cactus, because iron's cool. Where's my iron? Oh, my iron's gone. Alright, so. Uh, I don't know whether to use it yet or not. It's quite a fair bit away where we're heading to. I think it'll take a little bit of time. I don't want to skip, though, because I have things to talk about. People to see, things to do. And if you notice, there are lots of holes around my world. That's because I am obsessed with getting records. And to get records, you have to get creepers. And to sort of get the skeletons to kill them, you kind of need to get close to the creepers. I'm not very good at getting far away from them. And then they explode. And it's not good. It does not make me feel very well. And if I can get over here, let's... Oh! 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 Run! <laughs> oh, I was trying to make him look sad, but then we're interrupted. How rude. Alright, so, uh, if we keep on heading through here, eventually we'll get to where we need to go. And it's quite exciting. If, I don't know if you guys will know what it is yet. You will know when we're getting close to it a bit, but you won't know what it is at the moment. You're probably like, where's Captain Laser Guns taking us? Is he taking us to the new Captain Laser Cave? Well, no. But I could, if you want that. I don't know whether you guys want that. Do you want that or not? Ice makes me go so quick! Oh. Oh, wow, I'm already out of food? Let's eat some pork stuff. I remember back in the day when we didn't even have a hunger bar. Those were the days, man. Those were the days. Alright, so I'm actually going to kill this pig. Die, piggy. Yeah. And I've had a really long and stressful day today, so making making an episode, it's quite a good change. I enjoy making episodes for you guys. It's, it's something I do for as much as you guys as I do myself. I never actually thought that I would get big with YouTube. Like, I can't really say I'm big at the moment, but I'm a lot bigger than I ever thought I would be. Trust me, when I had like 10 subscribers, I thought that's where I would stay. And now I've got like a thousand three hundred, I think. And every couple of hours, I get new subscribers, so that's awesome. It's going up by itself. It's my channel's definitely getting up there. It's not in the big leagues yet, but it shall be soon. What? Good. No. No, that's so rude. All right. So if I can get up here, and basically. I'll finish up the episode when we get to this place, because there's not really much else that we can do there. I've already explored it a little bit, and uh, there's not much, except for the main thing there. That's sort of, sort of the reason why I'm taking you guys there. Or I could just end the episode now, and you guys would be like, What is it? And leave you in suspense until the next episode. I could do it. I could do it. I could just kill these pigs for the next 15 minutes. But hell. That would make for an awesome episode idea. Alright. Go away! Alright. So we're almost there. It's just over here. And see that thing? It's all like, whoa, what is that? You'd be walking along and be like, hey man, what's this? And somebody would be like, I don't know, why are you asking me? And then you'd realize that they're a taxidermist. Do you know, I, I have no idea what that is. I don't. Ah, I'm just in a really good mood today. All right, let's let's get down here. And if you can't tell what it is by now, well, it's pretty awesome, I must say. And oh, silverfish. Oh no, I did not prepare for this. Um, I'm bringing. Oh no, this isn't good. I think I'm probably going to end the episode here, guys. I'm Captain Laser Guns. And I'll see you guys on the very next episode of Let's Play Minecraft. Peace out, and stay sexy.